everyone in the gun debate has a story. Absolutely, people care. And a perspective. I myself was a victim of gun violence. That makes a solution. Guns in America, it's, it's a big, big, big business. Ever so elusive. Let's start with guns. Oh, I'm shocked. Republican Senator Ron Johnson hears those stories. I have people come up to me, hey, you got, Senator, you got to do something about this. Support background checks. But then I have people who own guns and say, don't, don't go down the slippery slope. In an interview with 12 News Wednesday, he cast doubt that much of anything will happen in Washington. So you don't anticipate much going anywhere in terms of background checks or red flag? I, I, don't, I don't see the dynamic having changed much. I, I don't see the reality having changed much. President Trump added to the complexity Wednesday. Oh, I have an appetite for background checks. We're going to be doing background checks. After appearing to question in recent days whether the current system was good enough. The public seems skeptical, too. It's going to be very hard for them to change anything. Despite polling showing a majority of Wisconsinites and Americans say they support universal background checks. Listen, if I really thought expanded background checks would prevent, prevent these tragedies, you know, I'd take a more serious look at it. All right, Matt, if Senator Johnson doesn't think expanded background checks will work, what's his proposal? So in our interview today, he focused a lot on securing schools and helping districts, he says, for example, install locks on their classroom doors and safe corners. All right, we'll see what happens. Matt Smith reporting live in the newsroom.